It's too motherfucking early for this shit. Even if you are not ready for the day, it cannot always be night. Sir, fix that do work. Good morning. Um, it's 5.14 now. I'm sure to work out and then shower, get ready, and go watch the sunset because the sunrise. Because I love watching the sunrise, but I never wake up early to do so. So, yeah. Praise our way out the grave, dog. Living, speaking, praise God. Walking out the graveyard, back to life. I serve, follow your word, see with new sight. Into the night. Yeah, this life I'm living. All the advice been to them. Give me that grip, no slipping. Out of my mind. But I am trying to make today like a very productive day, so. I have like 20 minutes to shower and get ready because I want to go watch the sunrise and then we'll go eat, take my COVID test, go to class. Oh, I need to make my bed still. And go to Target, Trader Joe's because I have to buy groceries and snacks. And then I have to read and catch up with my assignments. I, I feel good so far. I don't know how I'm functioning, but I feel good. Like. I feel powerful, like better than everyone else because nobody else is awake. I was like very young without even knowing I would just write about my day it was like a diary kind of but it's cool to be able to look back and see like my growth and like remember all the good things that happened to me all the bad things that happened to me and it's just it's just cool I also like taking this time just to like breathe and really appreciate the moment and appreciate the little things and that's something I'm really working on this year because I would always just look into the future and just try to see what's my next step in life and not appreciate where I was at the moment and I do regret that a bit but today I also wanted to write start writing more of like things I'm grateful for um, like at the beginning of the morning just take the time to really think and appreciate the little things because I feel like we all take it for granted and we don't appreciate what we really have it's a beautiful day. I feel like I'm on top of the world, literally. Who is she? My hands are freezing now. I should go back. But I'm so excited for this semester, for this year. I wish everyone the best year. Um, I could feel good things. Regular sugar. What do you need? You just do what you do. I'll try that. I'm 
I'm a whole for creamer. Like I don't put no sugar, just oh, straight up creamer. Okay, but it's just not like, not that much. Let's go. It, when it turns white, that's when you know it's good. You said a little bit? Yeah. Down like that? Ain't that there? Diabetes runs in the family. <laughs> <laughs> now you put it in the wood. You put it in the wood. It's too sweet. It's not sweet. <laughs> I mean, it's not bad. I don't, it is too sweet. So, what do I do? You fucked up already? No, just some more coffee. If you're not a coffee expert like me, oh my God. you have to leave some space so you know when you fuck up. <laughs> Mix it. You know when it's like when the creamer is a bit darker, that means that the coffee is stronger. Yeah. It's called math and art. My coffee. Oh no, I actually like this. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I like okay, it like that. It's not as bitter. Wait, I want to try that. Oh. This one's just straight up sugar. It's diabetes. Like, oh. Yeah. Oh. It's because I don't. It's it's but it, it's, it's, but it's, it's not. Sweet. Yeah, but it's not bad. Mm. I've had coffee that's like. I have to give a drink that shit. Guys, I went to the restroom. I got fucking diarrhea from the coffee. Do not recommend. I don't know what the f UFC be putting in their coffee, but that shit did not make my stomach happy. And now I'm running late. Like, even though I woke up early, I'm running late to my class. But, like, you know, it gives me this sense of adrenaline, and I kind of like it, you know? <sighs> I don't feel tired. I guess that's good, right? But I'm just gonna put some quick concealer and mascara so I don't look dead and people don't get scared. Like, I don't know if that was TMI, but I was about to fucking throw up. <laughs> it literally hurt my stomach so much. Never drinking coffee again. I literally have 10 minutes to go there. Yeah. And I'm also scared because we have my class is like a seminar, and but the professor's really big on like class discussion, and he makes sure everyone participates. And there's only like 15 students in that class, so if I don't talk, he's gonna be like, "Oh, Diana, what do you think?" And I'll be like, "Yeah, mm-hmm." They need to stop embarrassing me like that. Like now I remember why I don't drink coffee. I just drank coffee because it's part of that, you know, that girl aesthetic, Miss Emma Chamberlain, drinking coffee every like three times a day. I don't know how their body works. That just no. I need to go. It finishes at 12, no? I mean at 11, 10, 50? Guys, I'm back in my dorm now. And it's funny because like when you're online, you can't really see people's height. But everyone was like short. And it, it was so weird because I've always been so insecure about my age. Because I'm like, college students are going to be tall. But my professor is like 5'5". Five, five. <laughs> It was so cute. <laughs> like, yeah, he's taller than me, but still, it was just, it's just weird. Because, like, I have such a bias for, like, size. And my sizes, probably. But, like, if you're short, like, I instantly trust you. And I just felt, <laughs> I felt so welcome. <laughs> That's dance party. Or someone coming. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we literally walk all around campus carrying this shit and all of this. Okay, but now we're gonna do a taste test. Let's try these. What are these called? Uh, take a 
chicken tikka masala. Chicken tikka masala. What she said. Hot time. Okay. Actually, we got this at Trader Joe's. Some limones. And some chumming. Chicken chumming. It's chicken? I'm just sure. But it's low fat, so we're going to be healthy. And then, oh wait, we also got this. My friend Bere posted this on her story saying it was good. So we're also going to try that later. Target, we got some go -Gurt. Yeah, Freezer? Freezer, right? Freezer? Oh, you just like pass them that. Or they, they don't normally go in the freezer? No. no. And then some Belvita cookies. And then Milano cookies. That's it. Now we're going to try this food. Like, it looks bomb. Okay, let's try this. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. The woman was too stunned to oh, speak. Uh, that, don't ever get unsweetened tea, guys. They have like jalapeno. Mm. They're like juiced and jalapeno. They're really good too. What do you rate it? 10 out of 10. Oh, shit. The rice, it, I always I'm not rice. eating that shit. I'm going to try this now. Okay. I already know. Oh. Why she got an hourglass body? That's an hourglass. Look at this. Just a sip. Yeah. Just a sip. Just a sip. So good. Just a sip. Just a sip. We're gonna have to wait until it stops sizzling. Okay. Look at her. Come tell it to Okay. Cheers. Oh, I need to cleanse my palate. Okay. Yeah. Dude, this shit. Now she's still drinking it. It tastes what I imagine. Like, I'm not even gonna say it because we're eating. <coughs> I just gotta go. Stop. Ew. It's like the world's okay. against me today. Okay. Cheers. <gasps> it tastes like. Okay, like lemonade sprite. It's good. It is yeah. good. It tastes like lemonade sprite. Yeah, that's good. Okay, see you later when we watch a movie. Yup, update. It's 3. It's 310 and I'm already tired. I think I'm gonna get in the side. Are you hurting me? Let me look at my to-do list that I wrote. I still need to catch up on my readings. And that's it. Wow. And that's going to take a couple hours, but I don't want to do that. So I don't know what to do. So I'm thinking I'm going to rearrange the whole room and stay. <laughs> this is the current setup. But this is too clustered over here. So I'm thinking to move the bed where this is at. And yeah, let's just see how this goes. And if it doesn't go good, <laughs> then that's what I'll spend the next hour doing. Okay. Time lapse time. All right, guys. So I don't know how I'm feeling about this. So I feel like I'm going to put the desk on this corner. Guys, I really can't decide. So I'm gonna let you guys decide. How we choose which way to organize the room. One, two, or three. Comment down below. Thank you very much. But I'm lazy right now and I don't feel like moving anything else. So I'm gonna go get in the sidebow and then start reading. See this there. And we got the side. Yep, it's cold and my hands freezing now. But it can't look so pretty. Alright guys, it's currently 4.57, about to be 5. It's almost hit me. And the sun's starting to set. It looks so pretty like You can't see. But yeah, so pretty. And just want to reflect on my day. I technically woke up at 7.30 because... I couldn't, 
I don't know, my brain just decides to wake up before my alarm. Um, but I was, the hardest part was obviously getting off, out of bed when it was cold in the morning. But then after that, I was like, okay, let me go brush my teeth, use the restroom, and then come work out. And that went fine. And then I went outside and journaled. And then after I came back from that, I kind of was hitting the wall at that moment because I told myself, try not to take a nap and try not to use social media. And I didn't know what to do. So I did go on Snapchat for a while just to see what my friends were doing. And then I was like, no, I need to stop myself. So then I started to do my reading for my class and then I went to class. So yeah, and then after that, honestly, I felt so good. Like, honestly, I felt happier in a sense. And I think it's because I felt more productive. But right now it's five. I still need to read. So, so if I read, then I feel like I'm going to start falling asleep. So then that's when I'll hit my official wall and then just... Call it a day. on like tiktok use notion so i decided to give it a try and like organize my whole schedule so i already did two classes <laughs> but now we're gonna go eat dinner it's currently 7 27 one plate and then my salad and then we got croutons and lemonade. it's currently 9 38 and i'm just tired now i usually sleep at like 12 1 2 depending on what i'm doing because I feel more productive at night. Like, I get so much energy at night. But I'm tired. Like, I just want to lay down on my bed. Like, I made a deal with myself that I wouldn't get on my bed. Because I know I would take a nap. And then I told myself I wouldn't take a nap. And not go on social media. And honestly, I was so productive today. I got so much more energy. And I think in the morning was the best aspect like just taking some time to really live in the moment and like focus on my breathing and being able to appreciate all the small things in life just makes you more grateful and more um just it's it's been a good day and i would definitely continue to do this if i wasn't a procrastinator and wouldn't do shit last minute but we're gonna see but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Make sure you also subscribe. 80% of the people who watch my videos aren't subscribed. What are, you, what are you guys doing with your life? Just kidding. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys. See you next time. Bye.